Hey guys, how's it going? George Price here again um, with another Mass Planner tip for you. I'm going to show you right now um, something that I, I kind of learned when I very first started using Facebook and it's very powerful and it's very um, it's very responsive. Um, you'll get lots of people that will respond to you in this, you know, with using this method. But with further ado, let's go to it. Um, it's uh, Facebook messaging, okay? And as you may have done um, when you first started using Facebook, okay, um, is you joined a lot of groups, okay? You join a lot of Facebook groups. Everyone told you, hey, join a lot of marketing groups. Search internet marketing and join these groups and uh, interact with the people in those groups. How do you interact with the people in those groups, okay? You send them a nice message. Um, don't be too spammy. Um, ask for a firm request, send them a firm request, blah, 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 all right? Great. So many people do it. You'll, you know, be told different things if you do it. Listen, I'm going to tell you this here. If it makes your life easy, okay, and if the right message is sent out to people, use it, okay? And I'm going to show you a way that you can use it, okay, on autopilot, okay, using a mass planner, all right? So basically, here goes. So you locate your favorite group on Facebook, okay, and um, it's going to show you here. You can do multiple groups, okay? You can do one group or one group of profile URLs per line, all right? So what you do simply is paste the URL in here. I'm not gonna do it right now because I have some, you know, things are extracted already and I don't wanna interfere with that. But you go ahead and you paste that URL in here, okay? Then once you paste the URL in here, URL in here, sorry, you'll click extract members, okay? What happens is the extract members will pull all of the members from that group, okay? Everyone, your friends included, all right? Then it'll go here to where it says use members. You click there, okay? And I'm gonna uh, basically blur all of this stuff out, okay, in this here. Um, but it's gonna basically give you all of the information of the members in that group, okay? And as you can see, that group that I searched had uh, 2,656 members in that group, all right? So what can you do with these members? You can message them your message, okay? I do not recommend sending links in your messages simply be, even if it's a link to a Facebook group, okay? You don't wanna send links because if you send links, people will report, report you as sending spam in a heartbeat, all right? Don't send messages very long. Um, just send a, a, a simple message, you know, like that a friend would send, okay? Think about it. If, if you're a friend, um, you're gonna send a message that's really quick, like, hey, George, how are you doing? You know, um, what are you up to today? Or, hey, George, you know, I, um, I found out about that, you know, um, nice television that you bought. And if you could tell me more about it, that would be great. And don't just randomly say about a nice television. Look at their profile wall and find out that they just bought a television. Okay. Stuff like that. You want to have these type conversation starters in your messages that you're sending to people. Okay. And one great thing about Mass Planner that it offers as well is you can do spin syntax. Okay. Which means you can put a variety of different words or characters in your messages and it'll flip them. So one message may say, hi, you know, um, well, actually, scratch that because <laughs> if you're going to send a genuine message, right, you don't want to send those things. But you could send it based on, I don't know, um, date and such like that. And maybe soon enough, you know, we'll include some things in Mass Planner that will, you know, make it so that it can be very targeted to your leads that you're sending to. All right. But anyway, here's what you can do. You can send a basic message. OK, ask them how they're doing, um, you know introducing yourself basically okay and you can spend like i said some of the tax of which text of what you want to put in there and by doing that you can put hello their first name okay last name blah 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 blah, blah. okay group name where you found them if you want to do that okay um and also what i recommend that you do is you don't want to send messages to your friends so you simply select where it says ignore account you know account friends so any friends that are on your account or the account that you're sending from it's going to not send that message to them okay um, ignore members who already have received the message, which is very smart. <laughs> okay. And, um, remove selected members from the list after sending, after clicking send. So basically what that means is, um, the members that are on the list here. Okay. After send, you click send, it'll just extract or clear all of those. So that way you can go through the process of creating another list of members. Okay. Um, one thing you can also do. Okay. And this is up to you guys totally. All right. And this is a contact members module on mass planner okay you can use this to send friend requests so if you're one of those types that like sending friend requests to lots of people i don't do it but i know some people do you can do that with this tool okay 
Um, and once again, this is going to be sent to members that you've extracted from these groups. Okay. So, um, remove members selected from the list after clicking send. Okay. So once again, it'll just remove all the members here. Okay. Um, ignore members who have already received the invite. Okay. Basically once again, so if, if you've already sent them a firm request, it won't send it again. Okay. And you can basically click here, send, it will start that action and it'll start sending a firm request. So basically, all right, after you do either of these two actions, okay, cl by clicking send, it's going to send the message or what have you to the friend request, okay, and show you the status of what's going on. And as you see, I don't do the friend request thing, but it'll show you the status, okay? And it'll have a timer as far as how much you can send and such like that. I don't recommend changing any of these settings, okay? Simply because if you change the settings, you'll risk having your account banned by Facebook if you're going too fast. Because some people say, oh, I want to have a thousand friends in a minute. Don't do that, all right? Just don't do it, all right? <laughs> Leave them as they are. Um, this, these settings have been tested, tested, tested by the team and they're the best to work, you know, for what you're doing. Okay. And over time it'll grow. So just leave them as they are. All right. Um, and if you click the option of send message, okay, what'll happen is it'll come here where it says send messages. Okay. And you see, I have used this one and it'll once again, show you a timer. It'll show you the messages that have been sent. Um, even when I use a little bit of spin syntax, you know, with different variations of the wording and such like that it sent all of that information. All right. So, um, yeah. And it even shows you the date that they were sent. Um, you can browse to the message itself, copy it, browse it, embed it, what have you. Um, and yeah, this is a pretty cool tool. All right. So message marketing, like I said, it's very, very effective. Okay. Mass planner can do this on autopilot for you. Um, when I was doing it back in the day, I think I would got up to like about 91 messages in an hour. Okay. Before Facebook said, no timeout guy, uh, stop. But with this, um, it does it in a timely fashion. It, um, when I use it, I don't have any problems. I just get lots of messages back to me, lots of interest in my product or lots of interest in what I'm offering. Okay. And that's what you guys want to do as well. All right. <laughs> so see you in the next uh, mass planner tip. Uh, talk to you soon. George Price. Bye-bye.